Hey guys, welcome to another Ashes of Creation video, uh, the week-to-week -week podcast notes. Um, I'm recording this late Thursday night. Uh, it should be out Friday morning. Just going over recapping all the changes that uh, we should see implemented um, on the patch here tomorrow. Um, and the servers go live. So this week wasn't as many as last week, but there's still quite a few really impactful changes that were made. We had a total of 49 different uh, patch notes. Um, and so let's dive into it. I'm gonna, not gonna go over all of them. I think we're gonna switch to this more shorter format um, where we go over all the most important ones. Um, if you guys end up liking this video, uh, feel free to give it a like. And if you wanna see more content like this, go ahead and uh, hit that subscribe button. So let's get into it. Um, the most important things that they've added so far um, have been the damage and heal dampening experience debt. So if you are level 25, this is also really important. Before, there was no, um, when you hit that level cap, there was nothing to, uh, that was negative for determent, uh, uh, determent, adherent, sorry, I uh, can't speak English. Uh, to, to continue to die um, and they added that here with the damage and heal dampening I, I have no idea at what level this is really going to make impacts um, this can matter a lot, this can matter very little we'll have to see um, but it's a thing to note mean forecast, we're talking about that on the podcast uh, two days ago talking about hey when we hit level 50 uh, when the game is live how what's the point of XP debt? So it's going to be tied to damage and heal dampening, it looks like. So we'll see if they add any more um, uh, other things in the future uh, along that lines. So they also added uh, elemental empowerments to melee characters with the thrust attack for the uh, two-handed sword combo. This is awesome because this, this it felt like a lot of classes had uh, elemental empowerments. And um, I th I, this looks like it's probably going to be some something to do um with the two-handed weapon tree um not sure though this was the only note on it i just copy pasted it um haven't had you know we're gonna be getting in we'll test it i guess on uh, friday but that's exciting that looks like it's gonna be a buff to the fighter uh, quite a bit and as i'm the a fighter main i'm pretty excited about that so uh, another one is adjusting the respawn rate of all named MP npcs we don't know if this was nerfed or buffed, um, if it's going to be a shorter or longer uh, respawn rates. It did feel like things were taking maybe a little bit too long to respawn. A couple of areas, specifically Oakenbane, seemed like forever for some of these big uh, bosses to respawn. It's nice to see that. Um, uh, hopefully they don't do it the other way around where it's going to take longer. So, um, Guild Wars and Node Wars. Are two other big pieces here that they added um, a lot of different changes to a lot of bug fixes a lot of just quality of life UI changes so it's nice to see that they're doing that um, I think that's to be a big push especially on phase two to get that in a really good place and a lot of people are already doing Guild Wars I like caravan bugs we experienced quite a few caravan bugs this past weekend um, Going into last weekend on Friday, we weren't even able to launch caravans. They hot fixed that. Um, it looks like they fixed a lot of just general caravan bugs as well. A lot of people are running caravan uh, caravans to make money and make gold. It's a really good way to make gold. We're gonna be coming out with a video here. Um, it'll either go live this weekend, uh, maybe, maybe tomorrow or maybe Sunday that goes over how caravans work um, and how to maximize your gold output. So keep an eye out for that. Um, we added, or they added additional PVP options in the in-game menu. Um, this is to referring to uh, uh, splash damage uh, or AOE damage when you are flagged. Uh, you can now target it where are only damaging uh, other players who are flagged as well. So this is to prevent um, corruption baiting. Uh, great change needed to be done. Glad to see that's in there. Um, awesome, so. Uh, and then last but not least, Oops, there was a lot of duplication um, issues last weekend. A lot of players were able to get lots of legendary gear, lots of money from it, and uh, they, they put 
not a ban hammer down on these people, but for the people who were really abusing it, they just deleted their characters, uh, which is crazy. Um, I mean, it's up to them, you know, it's their game. For an alpha two, just deleting the characters it takes a long, long time to level. Um, I don't know. Um, I mean, it's good to see that all the dupes are gone. And I mean, if you have players who are just abusing it and it's the purpose of testing and they're testing progression as well. Um, but yeah, it, that happened uh, earlier today and it was kind of wild. We're checking, uh, I was checking Twitter and in the reactions and stuff on Reddit as well. And yeah, it's, um, that should be fixed though. So if you see any other dupes, do not abuse them. You have the potential to have your character delete if um, they deem it to be uh, too abusive. Um, so just make sure you put slash bug and put a bug ticket in. So, um, and then the last but not this isn't a um, a patch notes thing, but I wanted to say thank you for everyone um, past the hundred subscriber mark. We're actually pretty well on our way to the two hundred subscriber mark now. Um, but to celebrate, I'm going to be doing a twenty four hour stream um, starting six a.m. Saturday to six uh, a.m. on Sunday. So. If you want to tune in for that just stop by and say hi it'd be awesome um I'm, I'm, I'm really happy i can be part of the community and and um sh share content and provide information on the game um really proud about that and i'm gonna keep on trying to uh make the videos better and better so um if you guys have subscri subscribed thank you um and if you're not subscribed again if you like ash's creations and you're following it and want to see more content like this hit the subscribe button down below. Thanks guys, I'll catch you guys on the next one.